Hey, uh, boys! Yes, so... Remember that, yeah, that thing? Just... I... I will collect all the sun... Then you just click that, use space to cancel, like those boys... No! Yeah, so now, in order to make a sunflower, we're gonna have to like... Here, so I'm gonna duplicate the pea shooter, but this time make it sunflower. Now, wait for a while, cause I'm gonna design my sunflower, so please wait. Oh wow, that doesn't even look like the sunflower. Well, who cares, it's my version. Yeah, and here we are, my... Sunflower, as you can see, I added freckles and those devilish eyes. Help me, please. So, I'm just gonna copy this and paste her into the sunflower seed boy. So, now in the sunflower, we know it's 50, so instead, I'm changing it to 49 and this to 49 and 49. So, you know, because it's then it's here, this time negative 50. Now instead I'm gonna like 3, 3, then 4, f like 2, 2. I, I like I'm gonna test for a while, so the waist is 67 in mine, it's 67, so I'm gonna is. Seven, negative 79 plus 75. Okay. There. Okay, what happened? Okay, so we know that the... We don't need any shooting, but instead... We're gonna still keep this, and I'm just gonna rename the shoot to sprout where it will like make an animation where it releases the flowers remove this this detect zombie on the old x i'm just gonna delete the old x no i'm just gonna fix the aisle for a while so Okay, wait. Okay, I fixed it. There. Now, for this, I'm gonna make a, like, sprouting effect. Okay, uh... Okay, there. I finished with the, you know... Here, so, instead, the sprout is gonna be at... Okay, I'm gonna name this S, then S1, then S. So in here, like, um... Wait, so if this is... If this is like six, seven... Oh. Just gonna make an S ray over here. There, so now for the s sprout thing, I'm gonna like wait, pick random, so maybe 4 to 8. Set detect to 1. Set sprout to 12 this time. Then wait, point 0.1, I like point 0.1, or maybe. Also, I like, uh, you know, like, sprouting over there, so... 
yeah then I also want to add uh, brightness this one is the one that adds the good like good qualities to the no there so now I'm just gonna oh wait what I forget I'm gonna set the tick to one there so now you'll see the sunflower like sprouts like that now what about the sun what are the use of sunflowers if they don't do anything I don't know well so now that we have this, I'm gonna duplicate it and in here, like, touching pea shooter or touching sunflower, I'm gonna drag this over, I'm gonna drag this over he here, delete this, get the new block, so now we can't overlap the other layers. Now for the sun, make an, something called SX and SY, like this, this is going to be the like, so in here, go to SX and SY, change Y by I think 8, then here I'm gonna make a new one called speed X for this sprite only. Here, set speed x to pick random negative 4 to 4. And here, change x by uh, speed x. Change y by negative 1. Then change y by y. Now in here, I'm gonna set like set y to maybe 10. Then repeat like Yes, yeah, so I'm just gonna try. Maybe this one. Yeah, this allows the sun to like boom. Maybe the sun should actually be smaller. There, so now for the sunflower to work, I'm gonna like go on this. In this sprout 14 section, we're gonna free clone of sun. Put the here set SX and set SY to X and Y position. All we're gonna do here, we're gonna duplicate this one. There. Now let's try and see how it will work. Just gonna spawn billions of them that we can afford lots and lots and lots of these. Oh, yeah, and I forgot. So, this is the reason why we need the sun ID. Set sun ID to 2 and put it there. So, now just gonna collect all the sun. This is what happens there. Now you have sun popping out. So the reason why I set sun ID to sun 2, so if it's equal to sun ID 1, then that's the one that falls from the sky. Sun ID 2 is the one that, like, comes out from the sunflowers, like that. So, hope you enjoyed the video. Bye. Oh, yeah, I, I forgot to make walnut, but, yeah, in the next video. Bye.